Hey and welcome to a new Crocfix video tutorial. So as you see we have here a Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. And yeah, what we have here is a beautiful cat at the background, but we can't get into the phone. So if you forgot your password, your pin code, your pattern to draw or anything, um, basically your screen lock, then you won't operate the phone, you can't get into the phone. And with this video I will show you how to erase this uh, pin number or pattern or password and you can use your phone again like it was new. But keep in mind all data after this reset will be erased on the phone, everything. So your phone will be like new and you need to know your Google account and your password, otherwise you can't uh, activate or unlock the phone. Okay? So, uh, if somebody played with your phone and ch changed the PIN number, then you are screwed. Then you need to follow this. You will need the phone and you will need a cable connected to the phone and the other end connected to a device, not to a charger, only to a device. It can be another phone, tablet, PC, MacBook, Mac, laptop, whatever, but not a charger. So you connect the one end into the phone. This is because some data is uh, going here through. It doesn't need to be uh, connected to, to a computer with special software. The computer just needs to be turned on or a television. You can also use uh, USB-C headphones. All right, so once you connected this, you take your Samsung S23 Ultra, it does work also on the 23 and on the 23 plus. Okay, once connected, you will press all three buttons here. Okay, I know you see two buttons, but actually this button is uh, actually combined with two buttons. So if you press it up, it will be volume up. If, if you press this button here down, it will be volume down. So basically if you press up and down, it's same as you would press two buttons. So you click again to turn on the screen and then you click all three buttons here and you keep them holding until the phone restarts. And when the phone restarts, you release the volume down button. All right, so the phone is restarting. You keep holding volume up and the power button, but you did have released the volume down button. So keep holding this still keep holding. Sometimes the phone restarts two times. Just keep holding until you see the Samsung logo and still keep holding while the cable is connected. All right, there we go. Now we are in the recovery menu. So we can disconnect the phone now. Okay. And now you are in the recovery menu and you can scroll down with the side button here. As you see, volume down, volume up. And you will go and choose here where it says Vibe Data Factory Reset. This will erase the phone and you can activate it later with your Google account. All right. And it will erase the screen lock pin or password. So we click the power button to confirm and we go down here once and confirm it again. And that's it. And now we click on Reboot System Now. In some cases, you don't have wipe data factory reset. It means it was uh, locked by some other user or technician. Then you will need to use Odin software. But for this, you need to Google. Or maybe I do another video about that. So click now on the reboot system now and just wait till the phone restarts. And then you just follow the on-screen instructions. This is it. Let me know in the comments if it did work for you. If you have any questions, if you just want to say thank you because it did work. If you want to donate, you have the options in YouTube Supers or I have also a donation link in my bio and in the video description. Feel free to join, subscribe and like the video and see you in my next video tutorial. Thanks for watching. If the video did somehow help you, then you can buy me a coffee. Donations are always appreciated. Thank you. You find a donation link in my about page and in the video description. 
Please also like, comment and share the video. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel.